you know, sometimes people play it too safe and you make sure that the lights are perfect and the sound is perfect and you say the same things and you play the same songs mm -hmm. and you can play all the right notes, you can do all of those things, but then I think a lot of times people leave and go, oh, it's good. And I would much rather run the risk of going out into the crowd and playing and there's a chance it's not going to work. I think that if you run that risk, that's where you cross over into the show being, instead of it being good, it's great. Or it becomes when one, somebody leaves and goes, that's the best show I've ever seen. I think Will's goal ultimately is for every person in the room to leave the show feeling like they're really glad they didn't miss that and that that was an incredible show. Um, and it's not really, an, it's not like an ego thing, but I just think he, he feels like that's his job as a performer is to is to blow people away. Gone is one of my favorite songs on the record. Um, it was the one that took the biggest leap, I think, because it started obviously as just this real simple acoustic song. We lowered it a key. We, we tried it a bunch of different ways in the studio and um, I really wanted to build that one from kind of the ground up as well. And so we started, you know, with, with Ken Coomer playing drums and uh, really kind of working everything around a, that kick drum pattern. Kenny Greenberg came in, uh, we went to his place and got him on the lead guitar track. And there's just some cool spacey stuff that uh, I think really built some tension in the song. And I'm just real, real happy with it. It's one that as I listen back, I feel like we really got to the essence of the of the lyric and the meaning of the song. You're gone.